On the 6th, Pastor Oxu Park was invited to Hedgy Bragio TV, one of Brazil's top five broadcasting stations, for a 45-minute live interview. Hedge Brazil Broadcasting Station established a relationship by broadcasting Pastor Oxu Park's online Bible seminar during the pandemic. After that, two live interviews and the biographical documentary Life's Mission, produced by Zhao Luis, who was then the director of the programming, was impressed by Pastor Oxu Park's life and aired one after another, giving hope to the struggling Brazilian people. Pastor Oxu Park, who visited the station that day, was greeted by broadcasting director Jao Lewis and the host Giseli, who was with the remote live interview during the pandemic, interviewed Pastor Oxu Park again this time. Questions and answers went on various topics such as mind education, the Gracious Choir, and documentaries. Regarding mind education, Pastor Oksu Park introduced it, saying that God gave the ability to control people's mind and mentioned the meeting with the President of Paraguay. He explained how people are changed through mind education in South America and other countries. Host Gilly said she had a lot to learn from his documentary, Life's Mission. Many broadcasting stations interviewed Pastor Oksu Park and said that the meeting with Hedge Brazil was the most memorable. The host concluded the interview by saying that she supports Pastor Oxu Park, who is constantly changing many people's lives. In the middle of the interview, the Gracious Choir performed three times, making the interview atmosphere even more pleasant. It was broadcast live on the airwaves and the internet all over Brazil. Bom, a gente fica muito feliz porque a gente construiu uma amizade. Construiu uma família, né? a gente se sente parte da Missão Boa Notícia, os funcionários da Rede Brasil gostam do tema, começou a se fazer parte, começou a assistir, começou a acompanhar. Né? Quando a gente começou lá atrás, entrevistando ele via virtual, é, então fica um negócio distante, né? a gente fica, parece que a gente não vai conseguir se falar pessoalmente, e hoje ver ele aqui é muito legal, a gente ficou muito honrado da visita dele, e a gente espera que... Toda essa visita dele aqui no Brasil, agora com o presidente, com a primeira dama, é, fortaleça muito mais a missão Boa Notícia no Brasil. É isso que a gente torce, é isso que a gente vai ajudar sempre. Mind education and the gospel's message are becoming more widely known throughout Brazil. I hope that it will become an opportunity for more Brazilians to return to God in the future. This is Good News TV, Jen Constantino.